Hey guys, Ash here from c 4 Tech and the official Android 4.4.2 KitKat release for the Galaxy Note 3 N9005 is now out. As always with Samsung's firmware updates, it's being rolled out via regions. The first region to receive KitKat is Poland. So in this video, I'll be showing you how to flash Samsung's official release of Android 4.4.2 for Poland onto any Galaxy Note 3 N9005. So the prerequisite here is that your model number should be N9005. It doesn't matter if you're rooted or unrooted. It doesn't matter if you're on a stock or custom ROM or even on a leaked version. Since this is Samsung's official release for Poland, this will not be triggering any counters. This will not be affecting your warranty status. So what's new with Android 4.4.2 for the Note 3? Well, I have a separate video about that. I'll leave a link to that right below the like button in the description. So if you want to know what's new before you flash this, go ahead, check that video out. So guys, if you're coming from a stock ROM, this should not be deleting any of your apps or data. But if you're coming from a rooted custom ROM, odds are your apps and data will be lost. So either way, make sure you back up your apps and data just to be safe. So anyway, uh, assuming that you are on a N9005 and you've backed up your apps and data, let's proceed. So guys, the first thing you do is hit link 1 from the download section in the description. That will take you to this page. So over here, download keys 3, install it and make sure you exit it. Make sure it's not running in the background. This is necessary to set up the drivers for your PC to communicate with your phone. So the next thing from link to you download odin3 underscore v3.09.zip and link 3 will get you the firmware itself. This is the official 4.4.2 release. So download it and uh, once you've done that extract this and then extract this as well. So now go ahead, turn off your Galaxy Note 3 and with your Galaxy Note 3 off, hold down volume, power and the home button at the same time. And once you see this, hit volume up. So right now connect your Galaxy Note 3 to the PC with a micro USB cable. So over here you can use the micro USB 3.0 cable that came with your Note 3 or a regular micro USB 2.0 cable, it doesn't matter. So now quickly jumping to Windows, uh, right click on Odin 3, run as administrator. So guys, right now, as long as your drivers have been set up right, this would be blue. If it isn't blue, make sure that Samsung Keys isn't running in the background. If it is, make sure you uh, close it. If it still doesn't work, uh, uninstall Samsung Keys, reboot your PC, reinstall it, reboot it again, and then plug in your phone and it would work. All right, so... Uh, it might say i9505 over here, but don't worry about it. Uh, this is Odin 3 v3.09. It works with uh, the Galaxy Note 3, so don't worry about that. So what we do right now is uh, head on AP and navigate to wherever it is that we've uh, downloaded and extracted 4.4.2 and select it. So the file that you extracted would end uh, with .tar.md5 just add it for a few moments you'd see uh, Odin 3 would seem not responding would seem as if uh, it's frozen just give it a few minutes it'll be back so guys once uh, once it's responsive just go ahead hit start so this will take about five minutes to complete five to ten minutes uh, I'll be back with you guys once it's done Alright guys, once you see the blue reset there, your phone would reboot. So at this point, you can disconnect your phone from the PC. And you can also exit Odin. We are done with the PC part of this tutorial. So you'd see the screen Android on screen. So wait for it to get done and the phone will reboot. So guys, keep in mind the first boot is always longer than your regular boot times. It might take a little bit longer than usual. So just wait for it to boot up. Uh, don't panic if it takes a little longer just wait for it and your Galaxy Note 3 will boot up so guys in case your Galaxy Note 3 fails to boot up get stuck at the Samsung uh, logo with it playing over and over again uh, you could either pull out the battery or press and hold the power button to turn it off and then press up volume home and power at the same time keep pressing it till you see Galaxy Note 3 display it, then let the keys go this will cause you to boot into recovery So over here, the volume key is double for navigation, the power key for selection. So scroll down, select wipe data factory reset, hit power, 
scroll down select yes I'm not gonna do that now again scroll down select wipe cache partition do that once you're done go back and reboot system now so now your Galaxy Note 3 will definitely boot up and you can restore all your apps and data from the backup you made earlier so here we are guys and uh, as you can see my data has been retained since I was on the stock ROM I was on the stock leaked Android 4.4.2 so just to show you quickly heading into settings general about device there you go KitKat so I guess that's pretty much it when it comes to flashing the official Android 4.4.2 onto your Galaxy Note 3 and 9005. So I hope you found this video useful. If you did, go ahead, give this video a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button. And to stay updated on the latest in tech, make sure you check out our partners at omegatry.co. Once again, that's pretty much it, guys. Thanks a lot for watching, and I'll catch you guys soon on the next one. Till then, this is Ash here from C4E Tech signing off. You guys have a great day. Bye-bye now.